Hey there everyone! We're here again for another video tutorial in engineering drawing. And today, we'll talk about some of the modify commands we use in AutoCAD. Let's start! Modify commands such as trim, move, rotate, and all such these are used to edit, change, and of course modify elements in your drawings. In our examples right here, we'll start with straight lines. We get vertical lines and horizontal lines. In our previous videos, we talk about how to use the different methods in drawing lines. If you miss those videos, you can check it out here. I'll put the links in the description below. So we start with drawing squares. You can have your starting point anywhere. I'll have mine at 25,25. There you go. So I sped it up a bit and we have now our squares with sides 100 millimeters. There are actually several ways on how to create those drawings. But right now, I will share to you some of the basics that most of the time I use in my drawings. In our first drawing, we got vertical lines. As I've said, there are several ways on how to do this, one of which is drawing lines from one point to another. The thing here is, you can use line command if there are at least two distinct points in your drawing. Right now, we have 10 divisions here, separated by vertical lines. Now, in order to have points in our drawing, what we want to do is to divide the line on top of our square. And if you wish to do the same with our bottom line, you may do so. To do that, you need to command divide or type in div in our command bar and then select the objects to divide. And then AutoCAD will ask you to enter the number of segments or divisions that you need. In our examples here, we have 10. Type in 10 and then enter. Now let's do the same with our line here at the bottom. So that is div or divide. Enter. Select the line. Enter the number of segments, we have 10, and then enter. Now, as you can see, we already have points in our lines. All you have to do is use our first modify command, which is the copy command. You can click here in our shortcut in the ribbon, or you can just type in copy,
in our command bar and then enter. And then AutoCAD will ask you to select the object you want to copy. Select the object. In this case, we have our line right here. Click and then enter. Now you will be asked to select a base point. Here, we will select this corner as our base point. And then next is to select a second point where you want to copy your line. Now all you have to do is to click each point where you want your lines at. Now let's do the same with our horizontal lines. Again, we have to command divide, enter, select the objects to divide, in this case, this line, enter the number of segments, we have 10, and then enter. And then we'll do the same in the other side. Again, we have to command divide, enter, select the object, type in 10 for our number of segments, and then you hit enter. And then next is copy this line to those points here. That would be copy, select the object, and then enter, and then specify the base point. Right here, our base point will be this corner. Click the corner, and then click the points right here. And that is how you use the copy command in our modify commands. So thanks so much for checking out this video. Hit the like button if this video was helpful. Subscribe for more videos just like this. Until next time, bye!